morning, day two of the great expedition. And that's where we slept the night. And Dougie, he's packed up my bag, yep. and we're right to go, Dougie. Beautiful spot here, no doubt about. Look at the way the clouds hang around the top of the hills. Oh uh, yeah, not much of a day for flight aeroplanes. <laughs> Let's hope it's a good day for, for trekkers. He's a bit hot. <laughs> he got his best socks on today. <laughs> We're going up the golden staircase. Into the ridge. Yeah. This is where things started to hot up. Yeah. yeah, this is where the final stand was to halt the Japs. Yeah. Uh, we've come to a spot here for our smoko. Jack's tail in, boy. Beautiful creek. Yeah, Dougie. Looking on. G'day Dougie. Everyone's sitting there in a bit of smoke over. Ah, uh, been terrific. It's the bottom of um end of the ridge. Right at the bottom. Well look at this. We just popped out into a little piece of paradise. Yeah, marked on the map as Ula Creek. Yeah, a little piece of paradise. Well, we've arrived at Irabara Village, way up on high, about 850 metres, and this is a spot where the, as far as the Japanese got. Just a beautiful village, beautiful sleeping huts. One of those places you, <laughs> you read so much about, and it's pretty magic to be here. Mm, way down this way, through the rain and the mountains, it's Port Moresby. And uh, apparently the Japanese could see the searchlights from Port Moresby airstrip from here. From here they received the command to retreat back towards Kokoda and the coast. And that's where I'm sleeping tonight. Well it started to rain. <laughs> Bucketing down. The first bit of rain. Look up on top of those mountains there. The mist and the rain everywhere. Down here's our eating house. The boys are laying everything out for tea. And we get, we really do get spoilt. And this is our sleeping accommodation. We stretch our sleeping bags out on the mats here, and we're as snug as a bug in a rug. That's our shower block down there. There's a pipe drops water down. In this rain, I think all I need to do is go and stand out. <laughs> well, good morning. It's pretty early in the morning. It's a bit after five o'clock. On day three, we're at uh, the village of Iurubara. I have terrible trouble with that one. <laughs> um, so far, so good. No aches, no pains, no blisters, no headaches. Uh, holding up pretty good. Anyway, every day we climb the Maguli Range. It's a big mountain behind us, so that will be a, a good test. I think we're at Naro Village tonight. So we see how the day goes. Another big day. Bring it on. Mm. Well, up there is the Maguli Range, and that's where we're headed. Stiff climb. Mm. My mate Dougie's looking a bit peaked. <laughs> We've done half an hour 
half an hour up the Magooley Range and Dougie's having a rest. Bridge is out here, all right. That's step one of the Magooley Range. Nice. You know, it's a good time to have a lolly and a bit of a sit down. Yeah, starting to see the Japanese fox off. It's hard to tell. Mm -hmm. Here you go. Marker of a trekker that didn't make it. Yeah, pretty steep. Little climb up here. Andrew Bergman died here, 14th of the 6th, 2006, age 35. He walked his track in the spirit of mateship with honour and respect for those who fought in the Kokoda campaign to serve and protect Australia and Papua New Guinea. Yeah, trenches up here. Trenches all in amongst there. This is Urubaya Ridge. Ridge. Yeah. They, they mm -hmm. were still falling, falling short or depending on weather conditions. Yeah. All along this ridge, the following trench lines. Yeah, yeah. Holes defending the Japanese advance up the hill. Mm -hmm. And we're just moving down to Offy Creek. A beautiful village just over here. Offy Creek Village. Crossing off the creek. Mm. And the boys have a rope strung out and we keep our balance that way. I reckon it's pretty damn good. It's about it's as good as a jet, isn't it? Yeah. I know, I'm numb at the moment. It's not bad. If it wasn't for the sweating, great. It's <laughs> awesome. I'm having a wonderful time. Ah, that Offy Creek crossing, that's the first of our good good log crossing. Filling up the water bottles and ready for the next run. It's all uphill from here. Probably if you haven't guessed already, I'm having a pretty good time. The knees are okay and the feet are okay and it's just amazing. Side of another trekkers death last year. Coming up this hill. Yeah. Yeah. Wasn't a bad hill. It just goes to show it. Um, not easy. Anyway, so far we're doing all right. Get way up this Magooley range. No, we're just taking it steady. Let's go, Dougie. Let's go, Dougie. <laughs> I'm coming up to the top of this rise here. Another trench system runs up along here. Trench system. Dougie's playing me a lullaby. Oh,